Okay, YouTubers, and this is just a quick video to show you how they downplay the modeling, and, and they do it in a huge kind of way. If you look at this screen capture from the NRC Freedom of Information Act documents pertaining to Fukushima, uh, what's being discussed here is a model being done by NARAC, N-A-R-A-C, and down here at the bottom, the relevant section that I want to discuss says all 96-hour dose projections, Alaska, Hawaii, West Coast, are well below the one rem total effective dose based on predicted cesium-137 deposition. Well, they don't talk about plutonium, number one. That's a big, uh, big flaw right there. But number two, this 96-hour dose projection. Okay, notice how it's, you know, not even a week. Not two weeks, not three weeks, 96 hours. And it's being based on that. And protective action guidelines and warnings or lack of warnings are being based on these downplayed in, in a temporal aspect, in the time aspect. They're downplaying the time of emanations. Let's look at another screen capture from the NRC for you documents. I will include all of these in high definition as I always do. And here's Jim Wiggins, an unknown male participant, discussing the quote unquote president's worst case scenario and the male participant says referring to the presence uh, case scenario it's bounding it includes the fuel in the three reactors the fuel in four spent fuel pools it does not include the common spent fuel pool around unit four nor reactors five and six or any spent fuel pools there and it's assumed a release based over a four to five day only period a four to five day period based a release based over a four to five day period we went 96 hours and we got four to five day and that's what i find in these documents it's a matter of days that they'll model for now let's look at some information sent to me recently by shazam thank you shazam and here is a actual tepco uh, plume map okay that's not a model this is a tepco plume map they actually have measurements uh, reading uh, radiation uh, readings on this particular if you look over here, they give uh, 1 by 10 to the negative 15, so on and so forth. They're giving actual uh, measurements. But what is important to note here, ladies and gentlemen, not only the fact that you have a plume, obvious visible plume that TEPCO is and not modeling, this is what they're detecting. Over here, look at the date, 3-29-2011. 3 2011 right? That's 18 days after the initial earthquake and tsunami okay we still have plumes and they're not modeling it these are measurements according to what i the way i comprehend these and let's look at another one and wow folks look at that 65 kilometer uh, plume that they're measuring and i've got some and i've already done a video on this i'll do it again i have a folder on tokyo where there's a 65 kilometer plume just like that but going in this direction straight at tokyo straight and some going out to sea where you know ships were right so here again, what's the date? 3-30-2011. 3-30-2011. And this is not a model. Again, here's measurements right here. It's a plume. It's a plume. So emanations are ongoing. Let's look at one more. Here we go from 3-30-11. There's a different varying times, but that's that same plume. See how it changes over time. But still, what a long uh, plume. What a long plume. And look at the date again. 3-30-2011. So I find these 96-hour and four to five days that's criminal man that's criminal they know better than that They're, this is their field nuclear uh, power this is their field and if they don't know better than that you guys are so incompetent we got to shut it all down anyway we don't have time to train people right shut them all down shut them all down so folks there you have it um the way they base their modeling and, and able to say they'll know harmful levels that's how they do it that's how they do it okay all right that's it hatrick pin you guys have a as radiation free a day as you possibly can all right, over now. We need to get subscribed and get this unity stronger and beat YouTube at their own game. Okay, that's what this is about. Like I say, go to the remix button, hit the remix button. That way you'll have this video.
and and keep up with this. Otherwise, you know, YouTube's just going to control us, guys, and it's it's really bad.